Hey Carl with APT, we're here at CES 2017 Unveiled. Uh, we're here with Nanshu from Rotex. She's going to tell us a little bit about uh, the product that she has here. What have we got? Hello, uh, this is uh, our electronic tattoo that is hair thin and skin soft. It is uh, stretchable, compressible, and uh, bendable. And uh, we can wear this tattoo on any part of our skin for wireless tracking of our vital signs, our muscle performance, our brain waves, our heart rate, and uh, a lot of uh, physiological signals, wirelessly and continuously. Very cool. Now, so, so do you have to put it on a particular part of your body to get those particular readings? Perfect question. Yes, you do. If you want to track your heart, you have to put it on the chest. That's the best location. If you want to track your brain activity, it has to be on your brain. If you want to track a particular muscle group, it has to be on that muscle group. But if you want to track something like temperature or hydration, it can be any part on your skin. Okay, and then how does this hook up? Do you do you get feeding, uh, feedback onto your cell phone, onto yes, your computer? Exactly. So currently, this is just sensors, and we have to have a rigid box which contains wireless Bluetooth chips and a rechargeable lithium-ion battery, and it's a reattachable one um, so that you can uh, get the data when you need. But when you are sleeping, for example, and you don't need the data, or you are showering, you just take the box off. Okay, and then. Do are these available now? Uh, we are going to make it available in mid-2017. Okay, any kind of price point that we're looking at on these? So we are selling a package that contains this box and the app and a, a couple of those patches and it's not going to be more than 300 bucks. Okay, that sounds really great. Thank you so much for your time. We really appreciate it. Thank you. All right, guys, CES Unveiled 2017. Make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel to stay up on everything that's going on here. And make sure to check out blog.app.com to keep current on that stuff, too.